Welcome back. I'm Andrew Snicker and welcome into Fox 31 Sports Saturday. Well, a year ago, the Albany Panthers Columbus Lions rivalry actually meant something to the Albany team. A lot has changed in one season after a league championship and a returning roster loaded with veterans. The Panthers are seeing things differently. A game against the Lions is just another game. But tonight, it meant a little bit more to former Lion Damian Daniels. He might have been the only one. The defensive back has been looking forward to this game for a while. Now, right off the kickoff, fireworks for the Panthers. Check this play out. Offensive play for the Lions, but the Panthers creating turnovers here. LeVance Richmond picks it up. Drops it and then watch him go. He didn't get touched in the end zone. And he's not going to get touched all the way back to the other end zone. That would be a touchdown for the Albany Panthers. They go up 7-0. to zero. Now later in the first, 8-3 to three Panthers. See Celester hooking up with Antoine Savage. Albany's offense rolling on in this first quarter. Now moving to the second. Panthers still leading and still leading strong. 26-10. to 10. Lester hitting Clinton Rafe on the crossing pattern here. And he's off to the races. Another touchdown. Now final seconds of the half. Some controversy here. Scored 36-20. to 20. Panthers trying to score again, but Lester's pass is ruled an interception there. Bounces off the wall, usually ruled incomplete, but it was not this time. And head coach Lucius Davis not pleased with the call. We end the half at 36-20. At the break, coach Davis talked about the officials' call and that first half. Any pass that hits the wall is dead. So, um, you know, they, they missed that one. Uh, you know, so, I mean, I can't do nothing about it. I mean, they human, they make mistakes also, so I ain't worried about it. We got to capitalize when we get the ball. So, uh, we come out the second half and score, and then we get it good. That second half, the Panthers maintained their distance, keeping a 17-point lead. Albany holding the number one offense in the league to just 40 points. Impressive tonight. The team moves to 5-0 with this win. Final score, 57-40.